Hello students, this is Madhurima Mies. In my previous video, I have already discussed about how to find out object in a sentence which is very very crucial in case of changing a voice because without finding out or identifying the object in a sentence, it's not possible to change the voice. So therefore, the point is if a sentence does not contain object, you cannot make the voice change of that sentence. Now, after finding out the object, you need to to find out the subject which is very easy now you have to find out the doer in the sentence the verb the verb that is working or showing what kind of work is going on in a sentence who is doing that whether it is a person or a thing whoever is doing that in a sentence that person or thing will be recognized will be called subject now for example let's come to this portion where i have written peter plays football now the work of playing football is being done by whom by peter who is doing this work who is doing the work the work here is plays the work in this sentence, the verb in this sentence is plays. Now, who is doing this work of playing football? Peter is doing the work of playing football. Therefore, Peter will be recognized or Peter will be identified as the subject in the given sentence. Now, once you identify subject and object and verb in the sentence, you need to memorize the formula that i have presented on my screen now what is the formula for active voice in present indefinite it's written as subject v1 object s for subject v1 means v1 refers to the first form of the verb that is if i say go went gun then go will be my v1 which is the base form of the verb or the present tense now after subject b1 comes the object which i had already mentioned in the previous video how to find it out in a sentence now once you find out what is subject and verb and object in a sentence for instance in this case in this case plays is my verb now plays is v1 peter is my subject and football is my object now once you understand the structure in a sentence you need to understand how you can match it up with the formulas given here now subject b1 object is the formula for active voice in case of present indefinite tense once you understand you have found which formula or which tense is being used in a particular sentence you will understand the uh, passive format you will understand that this is the passive formula that you need to apply in case of changing the voice now in this case in particular case of present indefinite tense the passive formula is object am slash e slash r means you, have, you need to choose according to the subject if the subject is i you have to choose am if the subject is singular you need to choose is if the subject is plural you need to choose r now object plus am is a plus v3 v3 refers to the third form of the verb which means past participle and after writing v3 you have to write by after by comes the subject now let's come to the example here as i have said peter is the subject plays is the verb football is the object now according to the formula object m is r plus v3 object is football in this case so i have written football here in the first portion i have written football which is object now football is a singular noun so football is followed by is after putting is i have to write the third form of the verb third form of the verb is played now played by the subject what is the subject in this case the subject is peter so i hope this will help you to understand how to apply the formula of present indefinite tense in case of changing in case of identifying the voice first of all and then in case of changing the voice thanks for watching my videos